welcome grade 3 this is our math class for today we still in unit 9 and unit 9 is talking about time and the objective for today students will be able to convert between different units of time through different questions so I need you please to open your student book page 122 Let me remind you with the units of time. We know that 60 seconds make one minute, and the 60 minutes make one hour, and the 24 hours make one day, and seven days make one week, 52 weeks is one year, 365 days, one year, 12 months, one year. So now you remember with me the units of time. Let me tell you something. To convert from big unit to a small unit, you will multiply. And to convert from small unit to a big unit, you will divide. Miss Sarah, we don't understand. Okay, let us see some examples. Here, three days equals how many hours? Okay, day is big than the hours. So I want to convert from day, the big unit, to hours, the small unit. So you told us that big to small, we will multiply. Okay. But to multiply, I need to, to have two numbers to, to multiply them. Okay, the first number is 3. And the second number to multiply, okay, I know that the day equals 24 hours. So I got the second number, the 24. So if I want to know the 3 days equals how many hours, I will multiply because I want to convert from a big to small from days to hours and if I'm going to multiply I have the first number 3 and the second number to multiply in is the day is 24 hours so I will multiply 3 by the 24 equals 72 so 3 days in hours they are 72 hours in another way as we did on last class i told you that three days how many hours day number one is 24 day number two 24 hours day number three 24 hours so 24 is repeated how many times three times so 24 times 3 72 so now you understand that you can make it in multiplication because you are converting from days to hours from big to small if you don't understand that you have to multiply to convert from big to small you can just do it as we did last class we said three days day number one 24 hours day number two 24 hours day number three 24 hours so which number is repeated 24 repeated how many times three times so i will multiply 24 times three give me the same answer 72 hours let's go to the next example 56 days equals how many weeks okay let us say that i have days i want to convert it to weeks so i'm converting the days to weeks from small to big from small to convert from small unit to big unit you will do what division okay the first number to use it in the division is 56 okay what is the other number i will use it in the division okay how many days make one week okay i know that seven days make one week so number seven i will use it in the division also so I will divide 56 divided by 7. I will divide all the days I have, 56 days. I will divide it by the days in one week only. 
that's seven days so when you divide 56 by 7 you got 8 so 56 days make 8 weeks or in the other way the 8 weeks make 56 days now next question 4 years equal how many months ok year and month I want to convert from year to month from big year to month small from big to small you are going to do what multiply okay so I need to have two numbers to multiply them to each other the first number I know it is four the other number one year 12 month so I will use the 12 so 4 times 12 equals 48 months so the 4 years is made of 48 months if you don't understand this way you can understand the other way 4 years equal how many months year number 1 12 months year number 2 12 months year number 3 12 months year number 4 12 months so which number is repeated 12 and repeated how many times four times so 12 times 4 equals 48 now let's go to the last example we have here 600 minutes equal how many hours okay I need to convert from minute to hour so from small to big if we are going to convert from small to big you are going to do what divide okay I need two numbers to make the division the first number I have it here the 600 okay the other number I know that how many minutes make one hour I know that 60 minutes make one hour so I have the other number to divide with 60 so I'm going to use the 660 to make the division of course in the division I should start with the total minutes we have the 600 all the 600 minutes we have divided by 60 minutes in one hour only so what multiply 60 can make the 600 10 multiply 60 can make the 600 so the 600 minutes make 10 hours or the 10 hours consist of or is made of 600 minutes okay let's go to our page 122 in the student book okay question number one join the question to the correct answer how many seconds in a minute one minute how many seconds 60 yes how many days in a week seven days in a week how many months in a year yes 12 months how many hours in a day one day how many hours from the signs 24 hours how many weeks in a year as we studied in the units of time 52 how many minutes in an hour huh? one hour how many minutes 60 minutes how many days in a year 365 days in a year how many days in a month between 28 and 31 because we know that we have February it is 28 days and we have some months in our 30 days and other months are 31 days we should check the calendar because the calendar is showing you the months of the year and the days in this month how many weeks in a month between four and five yes let's go to question two answer the following word problems a I ran sorry I run for five minutes how many seconds is that five minutes so he wants me to convert from minute to seconds 
So minute is bigger than the second. From big to small. What we're gonna do? From big to small, we are going to multiply. Okay. The minute, how many seconds? One minute, 60 seconds. Okay, so I have the 5 and I know another number to multiply with 60. Or in another way, you will say that minute number 1, 60 seconds. Minute number 2, 60 seconds. Minute number 3, 60 seconds. Minute number 4, 60 seconds. Minute number 5, 60 seconds. So, which number is repeated? 60. Repeated how many times? 5 times. So, 5 times 60 equals 300 seconds. So, the 5 minutes that I run every day equals to 300 seconds. B. My birthday is in 3 weeks. How many days is that? Weeks. I want to convert it to days. Big. Week. 2 days. Small. So, from big to small, I will multiply. The week is seven days. So, I know that I have three here and I have seven. So, I can multiply them. So, three times seven equals 21 days. Let's go to C. In four days, I'm going on holiday. How many hours is that? Days. Hours. We will convert from big day to small hours. So, when you convert from big to small, you will multiply. Okay, day number one, 24 hours. Day number two, 24. Day number three, 24. Day number four, 24. So, which number is repeated? 24. Repeated for how many times? Four times. So, four times 24 equals 96 hours. So, you understand that Four days is made of how many hours? 96 hours. D. My sister is exactly three years old. How many weeks has she been alive? So, three years. Years want to become weeks. So, big year wants to become small weeks. Big to small, we're going to multiply. So, you have the first number to multiply, 3. And the other number, I know that 1 year is 52 weeks. So, I have 3 and the 52. If I multiply them, I understand that the 3 years make 156 weeks. E. I have been playing football for 36 months. How many years is that? Month, I want to convert from month to year, from small, because the month is smaller than a year. So, month to year, from small to big. Small to big, I'm going to divide. I have 36 uh, divided by, I know that 12 months make one year, so the 12. I will divide 36 by 12. Or in another way, what multiply 12 make 36? 3 multiply 12, make 36. So, the 36 months is 3 years. Okay, question number 3. Make up two word problems like those above for your friend to solve. Actually, I'm the one who made the two word problems and I'm expecting the answers from you. So, you will solve the next two questions and send the answers to me, okay, as a message. The first question, I have been working in the school for two years. How many months is that? Question B, and the K, years, I want to make it in month. Year, month. Question B, I will go to Egypt after five weeks. How many days is that? I want to convert from weeks to days. So take care. When you convert from big to small, you multiply. But when you convert from small to big, you divide. Thank you, grade 3. Don't forget to answer the two questions and send it to me as message. See you later, alligators.